show you how to make a waterer um, using these pig watering nipples that you can buy from any tractor supply store. We just have it hooked up to the water hose and it's uh, basically an automatic water so the pigs can come over here and drink whenever they want to and we're not having to change out water every day. Show you how to make one of these and we'll show you how it's set up then at the end and hopefully dolly will show you how to use it okay. so we're going to go ahead and show you how to build this pig water that we have hooked up for our, our juliana um, this is the size nipples we're using um, they're called nipple drinkers they are half inch they just kind of look like that you buy them in tractor supply at the back where they have the goat medicines. Um, so we're going to go ahead and get this, get it out of its package. Make sure you buy some sort of tape to wrap around the threads to prevent it from so some of the other pieces that we are using um you can probably use any type of PVC pipe that you want to. Uh, we just happen to use three quarters because that's the type of fittings we can find at the hardware store. So I just cut a piece of three quarter inch PVC pipe. This is about a foot long. It really doesn't matter how long it is. And then I got these, this fitting here. That's what the hose screws into gonna go on like that and then we've got an elbow a three-quarter to a half inch it's gonna go on the other end like that and then we got a, a half inch uh, now this must have been a three-quarter well just make sure I think it's a three-quarter and a three quarter. Just make sure whatever you find, it all connects like it should. Um, and then we got a threaded end here. It's gonna go on like that. And then of course, then all you have to do is screw the nipple on in until it's tight. Um, so I would recommend before you glue this on, to go ahead and tighten up the nipple in there. That way you can make sure it's on there straight because you want it like this because then the pig's mouth is going to go on there and push this little lever down and that's going to release the water um, if you don't put it on first and then glue this it might end up tightening up to where it's crooked um, so we're going to go ahead and tighten up the, this little nipple here into this threaded coupling so I had to find a pliers to grip it. So I'm just gonna tighten it down. So it's tight. So, all right, Brindley, let's get the glue. 
Um, I don't think it's rocket science as far as PVC pipe goes, but I may be wrong. But I normally get an all-purpose cement and then the clear cleaner. You can get like a purple primer, but I just don't like the way that looks because then the purple bleeds down the PVC pipe. All right, so we got our nipple here. We got a piece of PVC pipe. Um, I'm gonna hold the pipe and Brindley's gonna clean it. Go ahead and get the cleaner. I'll just go around it a couple times. Do it, do it hard. Alright. Go inside here. Clean that. that back on so we don't knock it over. And and glue. And this glue dries pretty fast, so always keep that in mind. Don't ever touch it. Right. <laughs> Alright, so Brindley's just gonna pick take the glue and go around the outside here and go on the inside. So Go around the outside of it. All right, go on the inside here. All right, now we're just gonna take it and push it on there. Turn it just a little bit. And it'll set real fast. All right, so that's that part. Now we're gonna put some glue in the nipple part. Make sure your glue put some on that doesn't get on the screen in there. Yep. Or else it'll clog up the drinker. So now we're just going to put that on there and make sure the nipple is straight just like that. Let that dry. Now the last piece this piece here. Alright, so go ahead and clean it. Tighten it up. So we're making these for our mini pigs, our Julianas, that we raise here on the farm. Um, I'm also making one for our feeder pigs because they keep messing up the waterer that I showed in a previous video how to make. Um, it works really, really good there for a while until we had all the little piglets in there with them and then they just started knocking it out. You do have to watch out that the pigs don't fall in there. We did have one fall in. Alright, let's go ahead and clean this and so this is gonna allow the pigs to have fresh water all day long. Glue on the outside and on the inside of the joint here. Connector. Fitting, whatever you want to call it. Fitting. <laughs> Alright, go around. Alright, on the inside here. Alright, so now we're just gonna put that there on. And there you have it. Easy automatic pig water. Just screw your hose down to this end. Turn the water on, and you're ready to go. We do use um, the clamps, and we screw them into the wooden posts to keep it keep the pig from yanking it off. So that's we're gonna try that and see how that works. All right, so let's go look and see how Dolly is liking her water. So we just made the water. Came back down here to see how Dolly's seen if she's using her water yet that we just hooked up down here. Um, so let's go on and see. So 
this is Dolly and her two little piglets. And she'd already been using it. There's dirt all over it. <laughs> Apparently she came over here and was at least investigating. Um, probably drank some water. But we're just going to leave it alone. We'll figure it out. And we'll check back tomorrow again whenever we come back to feed her in the morning. I've just made an automatic pig water. Please like and subscribe for more videos. Bye! Bye. Hold on. I'm fighting a goat. Please like and subscribe. Wait for the goat to stop peeing. Hold it, good.